the summit of this volcanic mountain rises above the surface of the sea. It's Ascension Island, 800 miles from any other land, a welcome, vital haven for long-distance travelers. Frigate birds spend months continuously airborne at sea, but at nesting time, they come to ascension from all over the ocean. The island's barren slopes of volcanic ash and lava might seem to offer perfectly good sites for a nest. But the frigates choose an even more isolated site. Bosonbird Island, a lonely pillar just off Ascension's coast. Frigates are the world's lightest bird relative to their wingspan, and they can soar for weeks on end with minimal effort. They seem much more at home in the skies than in a crowded colony on land, but nest they must. They come from all over the Atlantic to this, their only colony. There are boobies here too. To raise their young, seabirds worldwide seek such remote islands. Swimmers also come to Ascension to breed. A female green turtle approaches the coast. She's not eaten once in two months. She may have traveled 1,000 miles from her feeding grounds, the greatest journey of her kind. Many others are here too, resting on the sandy sea floor, awaiting the darkness of night when it will be safer to visit the beaches. Eggs that were laid a few weeks ago at the start of the season are beginning to hatch. Most hatchings happen at night. Now, in the light of day, the young are extremely vulnerable. They must get to the sea as soon as possible. But their trials have only just begun. Many will drown in the pounding waves.